We did it. We did it. We did it. Through 69 Dares of Eternity, we finally got that fifth red border for the BXR Battler. Oh my God, it took forever. 69 times. That's the magic number. 69. That one. 69. <laughs> 69 times it took for me to get this BXR Battler red border. So let me repeat that. 69 Dares of Eternities that I had to complete this season just to be able to get five BXR Battler red borders so I can craft the one that I've wanted. It has taken me forever. 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 To get this, if you saw my previous video, you know that struggle was real. I was turning in treasure keys left and right, never got it. So, as soon as we got it, we crafted it, went to work, went to hit up the homie Shiro Chi, got on my hunter, used my tether, and just continuously grinded it out until we got to level 14. So I can finally craft the BXR battler I want for PVE. See, you probably thought I was gonna say PVP, huh? Because it's like the probably the second most used gun in PVP right now. It's really annoying. So no, I didn't get it for PVP. I wanted it for PVE for this role, as you see right here on the screen. Demolitionist and incandescent. So you know what that means? A lot of grenades, a lot of fire, a lot of things burning. And I just wanted a really good energy pulse to have in my secondary slot. And here we go. And for shits and giggles, the one the good old Jacarina Shader. I mean, let's keep it, let's keep it G, bro. Jacarina is probably the it's, it's easy top three go to shaders in Destiny 2, in my opinion. I think it looks one of the dopest, but yeah. So, 69. Again, 69. There's the returnees later. We are finally done crafting the BXR Battler. And I think I'm done crafting for this season. There's no other guns that I want to craft. May no, 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 no more. I've crafted, I don't know how, I've crafted, I don't know how many guns this season. This is the, this isn't season of plunder. This has become season of uh, crafting, or if you want to call it, crafting simulator 2000, whatever you want to call it. This is what this season has been about. I'm tired of crafting, I'm done. This was the last gun I wanted, and then we got it, and we're done. So, what do we do from here on now? See how the story unfolds, man. There's not really a lot to do in Destiny 2 right now. I appreciate you've noticed that I haven't been putting up a lot of Destiny related videos. And I'm gonna be honest with you. It's mainly just because I'm just not having the funnest time playing it, man. Don't get it wrong, I love Destiny, I love Bungie. This game is great. This game has got me to express myself through to my fans out there who are watching this video and to the people who care. So I love Destiny and I love Bungie. I'm just gonna be honest with you right now. Just not having the, you know, not having the most fun playing it. PVE for a while was fun, but even that's kind of starting to slow down. Um, it's basically just me waiting every Tuesday to do the idol story, and then we just sit, we just sit and chill. But I got a lot of crafting done. My crafting's finished. I'm good. This season I have crafted this BXR Battler. This other half, I also have uh, Amit. Uh, let's see, I did Wastelander, and there's a couple other things that I did also. Oh, Taipan, forgot about Taipan, and then there was one more thing that I did. I can't remember what it was, but I'll put it on the screen here if I can remember it or say it in a second. But, oh, Duma Chilches, uh, Scout Rifle, that's what I did. Other than that, I'm done. So, yeah, man, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. <laughs> remember, 69. I'm like, a, I'm like a 12 year old. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video, man. Make sure you hit that comment section down below and tell me what you feel about Red Border and crafting. I don't, I like it, but it's starting to get on my nerves. I think they need to revamp it some kind of way. It needs to be less time it takes for you to be able to craft a weapon. And also, come on, man, for the Master Raids, give better perks in there or something, please. Um, give them double perks at the least because Master Raids are just pointless, because I can just craft weapons that are way better than that, so... Yeah, crafting as a whole has been extremely 
boring over the last couple of seasons. I'm happy they did it, so I'm not saying that they should take it away. I'm not one of those dudes. But I just feel like there needs to be a better way of crafting weapons and a better way of grinding for weapons and craft. And it's a better way of leveling those up because the fact that I'm still doing Shiro Cheese checkpoint to level up my weapons speaks volumes. It could be that that's the quickest. So we got to find a better way and a more fun way to level these weapons up than just shooting, taking dregs over and over and over and over and over and over. And over. It's just boring, all right? But that's just my thoughts. Overall, I'm done. I'm good. I'm solid. 69. Anyway, anyway, make sure you hit that comment section down below. Tell me how you feel about everything. Make sure you subscribe to the channel for more content as I would appreciate it. And also, I would appreciate if you could leave a like on the video as it supports the channel and puts it in the algorithm for you to see my future videos. I love all y'all. And yeah, man, I'm out.